I know y'all sick of seeing me look a hot mess like this. Planning I'm going to come back soon, but I got a lot of projects, a lot of stuff I'm dealing with on top of me not feeling good doing all of this. So, um, I'm updating my website right now. And then, um, my ginger tea just got here. I ain't running out this time, y'all. Amazon, boo. This is my shit. Trust and believe me if you got GERD or anything like that. This is what you need. I got on a face mask. I'm sorry y'all been outside. But, um, yeah, honey. <clears throat> mm -hmm. So I told you guys that's the best tea. When you start feeling heartburn, indigestion, just sip that tea real slow. Don't add no lemon in it because lemon is not good for GERD. I know y'all sick of me talking about this GERD, but the shit has been taking me down the past three months. And I'm going to tackle it if I got to figure it out my damn self and invent something, okay? So, it is August. Leos, where my Leos? <laughs> All my favorite people, Leos. Oh, y'all, if y'all see this hair under this bunny. Um, but, yeah, Leos are my favorite people. Can't turn up with y'all this year. I deeply apologize. But if you don't understand why, I don't know what to tell you. It's a pandemic and I'm sick. So, yeah, let's go, August. Also, I'm sitting here reading the comments for my last vlog, and you guys are awesome, man. <sighs> yeah, I just melt my heart. So I'm in here steaming my face. <sighs> this crucial. My eye burn. Feel good, though. We're real good. I think it's like it for 10 or 15 minutes. Ciao. Hey, guys. So, ooh. I know y'all are tired of me looking like this. I need to wash my hair. Oh, it's my face mask. I need to wash my hair. I, I, it's a plenty of things I need to do, but it's post office run. You guys know how this go. I'm going to the post office, then I have to take something back to UPS. That needs to go back to Amazon. And then I need to um, go get some envelopes. So, I'm going to try to make this a one-stop shop or a two-stop shop so I don't have to do so much. Um, a lot of you guys from my last video, I wanted to explain this really, really quick uh, because I get this coming a lot. So, a lot of you guys under all my videos, you're always like, rest, rest, rest. You don't sit down, you don't sit down. And what I want you guys to know is I only pull out the camera when I'm doing something. So to you guys, I vlog monthly. So everything I do in one month is in one vlog. So to you guys, it may look like I'm doing a hell of a lot, but you all, you guys only see me when I turn on the camera, if that makes sense. So like, if I decide to rest all tomorrow, I'm not gonna turn on the camera and say, well, I'm resting today. If I decide to rest all week, I'm not, I'm resting today. So if you guys check the dates, that's timestamp. I don't even vlog every day. So it is the fifth. I am headed to the post office. Kind of a light day, but kind of not. It's this bag right here. It's full of goodies. So I'm gonna just drop this off real quick. I am working on the business video for you guys. How to shave, shave. How to save like a dollar on shipping and all of that and how to do this. What packaging to use and where to get cheap packaging. But I am literally about 20 videos behind. The companies are nagging me. I don't think they, if they watch my vlogs, they'll see I'm sick, been in the hospital 40 times. But that's neither here or there. Work still got to go on, I guess. But yeah, so I have a lot of catching up to do. So I'm going to start recording this weekend properly. Guys, I got all of this set up. Oh, this bottle of water so cold in my hand, I can't hold it. All of these bins are full. Here are a couple overflow of some vest. Like every single last one of these bins are full. So I just have to do my um, photo shoot and we're ready to rock and roll. By the time this vlog hit, we should be live, guys. So we'll see. I work today. I have to take a package now. It's open, so I'm gonna just buy it. Yep. I be getting so upset because much money as I give the post office. The lady go act like she couldn't give me a little piece of tape to do this because it's not priority. Like, you know, you got some clear tape or even like some scotch tape or something at the back. You could have patched this up for me. So now I have to take this all the way back home and tape it down. 
and bring it back and i'm not bringing it back i just give it to my mailman but it's just like customer service like it ain't like i got 40 packages asking you to tape up the whole fucking package and i understand it's not priority so i can't use y'all fucking tape but i know you had some tape you could have went back there to the back you know what let me just shut up and go home and package this the right way because she done irritated me all right guys so i'm sitting here <clears throat> i'm tagging my shaper but i got a problem because um my vest i don't have any 4x stickers so i have to put two 2x stickers on here <laughs> so i hope that don't cause any confusion when um somebody else have to help me pack my orders but i guess that's just as easy as explaining two 2x's is a 4x so i found some more yoni towels and so I'm cutting up some more samples that most of them look like this. Some of them might look a little different. Um, in the samples, there are strawberry, platinum bar, and golden cookie. So it just depends on what bag you got. Um, I had ran out of stock on these because I didn't have any more sample soap to put in them. But I found just a few, 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 few more. <laughs> so if they are in stock by the time this video load or if I get another shipment of them, then um, you can click below and buy the Yoni towels. Needed a quick getaway. What can I see out this window? Is the question? Is there a split? The okay, there we go. Okay. I'm gonna get under the tree like them. You heard me? That was a little too big for me. Looking a little germy. <laughs> Look a little germy at that pool, don't it? Very much so. Oh. <laughs> this is our first outing since the pandemic. Eating outing. The outing period, huh? <laughs> so, guys, you got me a little bit of fish. Well, you got what you get. Sure. And grits. Everybody spray them. I'm cheating on my own self. <laughs> <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> oh, yes. oh, they forgot your salad, so I'll be right back. Okay, thank you. This is the perfect overnight bag. Everything in here. Here. What y'all doing? Popping my back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these shrimp and grease so good. Let's get one to go. Two actually. Nicole, I always gonna do what I do. Just have to make sure. Woo! Let's go on the side where the shade is. Shade and get paid. Okay. Look at the view though. Like, oh my gosh! So beautiful! Oh. Get us a little yogurt. Look at that, she thick. <laughs> Later, got thick than a mug. Quarantine. Hold on, let me put my mask on. I got the healthy one, guys. Strawberries and almonds only. Yeah. This yogurt place. I think they need a sink at the door, don't they? You got a digging nuts and fruit. They should do like the money up to you. They got the um, containers, like you know the little sauce containers. They've got the toppings in there so you just grab it instead of digging. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> it's little Jeremy. Pray it over and keep it going. They got plenty of sanitizer at the door though. 
my brows so fleeky. They was looking like a mad woman and I just raised them. No product. Beautiful. Well, we came here with a grand idea to just chill on a balcony. Didn't get a balcony room. So it was like, you chill by the pool. The pool look like what? The pool. Nope, not them damn germs. <laughs> I ain't gonna do it. They tell us we can get free breakfast in the morning, but that would do that too, cause you know it's gonna be 30,000 people down there too, huh? <laughs> so it just defeated the whole purpose. I guess we got out though, huh? They said they're going to have a movie night tonight. I'm going down there without no people. <laughs> <laughs> we really should have stayed at home. Yeah, somebody over there no. got gas. Talking no. about this the chair. <laughs> really, it's always the chair or the lamp or the ring light. Last night, you talking about it was the ring light. Yes, it was. Most but it wasn't was. just now. Yes, it was. Do you smell anything? Yep. You don't. <laughs> You're trying to embarrass me. <laughs> <laughs> I toasted it. Shut up. It's good. What kind of shot is it? Banana split. You got chocolate, banana liqueur, and uh, rum, I think. We'll finish it. Hey. I just don't want to do it too fast. Give us a shot. Mm -hmm. Did what? What Nicole been doing on your bed? Putting the stuff up here. Home. <laughs> <laughs> Bullshit. But guess what? I heard you saying it came from my room. I was asleep, so what the hell y'all gonna get? Don't do that. Don't do that. But that's what they said. So it's 5 13. It's 5 13. I've been knocked the hell out for about an hour. Two. Oh, I was going to say, well, you don't know. Yeah, like you work for the fire department. What? Oh, yeah. We're 513 code right now. Look, Lord, if that alarm go off again, I'll just be coming to see you. Because I ain't getting up no more. So, if this alarm go off again, I, I see you at the pearly gates. I ain't, I'm not playing. It's this is a, ah no nah, uh uh nope. This is my look. She done happened at like five hotels I've been to. But I do go to hotels a lot. Yeah, the ghetto, and we are in the best part of Dallas. Ain't we we should we could have went through a cliff for this. First of all, the this is when I come back here to my right. Because the first time we came, what happened? They stole my fifty dollars. They stuck the. They came in the cleaning room while we was at the pool, and her money came a missing. Strike one. Then today, last night, they didn't give me my gold points or whatever, and my free upgrade. Tell my they didn't have no balcony rooms. Then we didn't get no sleep. The alarm clock started going off at one forty ish. We evacuated, ran down all them stairs. People got four hundred dollars and shit up here. But then we had to run behind dogs and shit. And I'm allergic to dog her. And then um, we finally, finally 
get downstairs. We have to stay down there for about how long, should? Like 10 minutes. Yeah, about 10, 15 minutes. We have to stay down there so long. Firefighters came out like, we don't know what the problem is. So everybody went back to their room. And it literally went out to what? Like two minutes when we came back in the room. No. To what time? Like five in the morning. Non-stop. So Nicole went downstairs. Bye. Nicole went downstairs and was like, what's going on? Y'all pumping us or not? It was like they will comp everybody who come down there and ask. No, y'all need to comp the whole fucking hotel, bro. Everybody is trying to sleep. Why do people have to come down here and ask for a refund? The whole hotel needs to be comped. But they come to stay, so we out. One of Nicole packages are in there. Small room for a Monday. I got one more to package up over there and I can go. So let's get it. I got more bins to give me more space up here at the top. They come six in a thing. So um, even though I only needed four more because I already had two that I didn't put right here. Um, I went ahead and got six in the code, took the other two for something. So yeah. Amazon is a plug, especially right now when I don't want to be out at stores and watch this Zoom. Especially when I don't want to be like out at stores and stuff. So yeah, let me package up this last order so I can get to the post office. Whoa, buddy. Whoa, buddy. Watch this. Watch this. I see mad at me. Look what I got you. <laughs> she want to fight me so bad. Come look. <laughs> what you going to say? Come this way. So I gotta move the camera out in the... Thanks. Oh, nah, I'm finna refund to send her. Get on. Get off of me, cause you can't... <laughs> Y'all, she can't be ready to find me cause I told her she need to wash the dishes. Yeah. Oh, cause you... Get up, get up. It's three o'clock. It is, it's you don't need to be still sleeping no three o'clock. It's 2.35. Girl. Her address. So I finished off her clear shoe boxes. <laughs> her little spoil so got a little short ring like. Oh now you wanna smile. <laughs> She's ready to fight me earlier, y'all. Cause Cover that like dress. woke up in my sleep. Huh? Girl <laughs> You go find you somewhere else to stay. Shoot. So my show like being woke up out of her sleep. Call me back when you're done. To you wash the dishes. <laughs> you don't want to wash the dishes? Who just want to wash some dishes? This <laughs> how you annoy your kids. Hey. Hey. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the container store. Got just enough. She says she need more, but... Uh, okay. Needs a lip gloss <laughs> business. Um, I bought about a thousand dollars worth of supplies. Um, her mom just gave me the money and told me to help jumpstart her because she don't have time. So I'm just gonna put everything off into this container as it comes. But let me sanitize, <coughs> wipe this container down because it's been in my garage. So yeah, I'm just gonna show y'all what I'm putting in here and let the music play. Made it to Ikea to get my new perfume stand. Let go. Hate this store, but they're not delivering right now. All right, guys, so what I came in here for is out of stock, but I don't want to make this a blank trip. So I'm trying to see if I can find something remotely similar. Um, yeah, I'm kind of bummed about that, but I swore I looked online, but I guess I didn't do a great job, so 
that's my basket. It's like doing what it want to do. I'm going to tear some shit up. Got to go, guys. So this is what I want. They're just temporarily unavailable in both colors. I just want to sit my perfume in there. Um, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I know that's out of stock because it's like dirt cheap. Yeah, I'm turning shit up. I need to get off this fucking phone. Oh, I see this one. Honey. But it's three times the price, so nah. All right, guys, so I'm gonna try my luck. Um, <laughs> there's two over here. I'm gonna be like, girl, y'all don't settle this one? <laughs> All right, guys, so mix some bowls. And oh, we back on this. Yeah, I just move around all day, don't I? So, I decided to take the um, purple organizer out because I want the one that's long that can hold the two lip glosses. So, also, an Amazon package came. So, let me show you guys what's in it. It's two of these heat guns. This is what I shrink wrap my hand sanitizer with, but she's gonna need it to shrink wrap the lip gloss. Um, I use my blow dryer, my T3 blow dryer, but I don't wanna have to keep taking it out the bathroom, put it in here with my stuff, taking it out the bathroom, put it over here where my stuff is at. And so I ordered another one, um, McCole. My baby cousin called her McCole, <laughs> but Nicole has a black one and I love it. It works. Perfect. So you know your girl had to get her a purple one. Okay. Don't worry about it, sweetheart. Why would I get it in any other color? Okay, and then I got a new Apple Watch band. All of this stuff you guys will see in my newest Amazon haul. I had to get this one. Girl. Girl. Oop. Oop. And I love it. So I'm about to go order another color before I do the video and y'all buy them all. All right, bye. What it's looking like so far, still got a lot of stuff to put in here. This is probably half of the stuff. All right, so, ice and I make my ice with essential water and wasted more than I'm look this ice maker came from Amazon and I'm gonna put my Gatorade in here I keep salty because this thing is a whole $50 cheaper than when I bought it I don't know what happened but bro I want my 50 bucks I paid 200 for this ice machine and it's like 159 now this cup came from Amazon too hot sweetheart love this cup excuse the grass the lawn people will be here Friday. It's Wednesday, yeah, Friday. So, yeah. Yeah, so I like to sit outside to get my vitamin D instead of taking, like, so many pills and stuff. You know, if you're melanated, the sun is natural vitamin D. Yeah. Rent a center out here looking for somebody furniture. Lord Jesus, I remember them days. So I just decided to turn on the camera. Of course, I'm not going to show y'all. I'm not that blogger, blogger or whatever. But I just want to turn on the camera and give Lord the thanks because I remember them days. Like having to rent furniture. Then couldn't even keep up with the weekly. Then they threatened me to take it. Never got to. As a matter of fact, my bedroom that I still have to this day came from rental center i've been having it a long time guys i ain't gonna lie i just i told you i'm just not one of them type of people that's like into home decor and stuff i'm not like as long as my shit function i don't care but now the more that i've been at home i do i guess that's because i've always been on the road or traveling and the cold could give zero fucks what is this thing from oh that's a water stain Like, when I say that girl can give zero fucks about anything, furniture, decorating, 
it can be a box she don't care so it kind of unmotivates me a little bit you know so um yeah moral of that story was thank you god i mean i'm going through a lot right now we all are well y'all might not be but it's just refreshing to see that truck and, and be like god dang the lord has brought me so far just found my vision board that was done on my cousin's new year's eve party and we are halfway through the year and i've killed it right yeah. it's like get lean get toned and as of today i've lost 40 pounds yeah i don't know about that less stress <laughs> we working on it lunch either the bras or the shapewear that's coming and expand makeup by platinum which i have no control over because we shut down but me and bay came to the conclusion that i did just not how i thought because now i sell products on the website so oh halfway through the year vision board almost complete <laughs> right, guys they told my shenanigans reloading the site lemongrass is finally back in stock i had to get the right oil i had tried some from another vendor and it, it didn't smell the same as the first one All right, guys, so I took the picture that pat fast and loaded it to the site, making a whole new bundle where you can get all five cents now. Um, yeah, it's up and popping. And then um, lemongrass has been restocked right here. Boom. So let's move into the lip gloss stuff. All right, so real quick, let me tell you what's been added. The tubes like this, more of these tubes, chunky glitter fine glitter um droplets i forgot what those things are called here's the packaging she can slide them in here put some little crinkle paper her favorite color is purple too then put the gloss in there boom she has pink gel another mauve gold blue too clear so she can make her own and some with some sparkle i think i'm waiting on two more things oh and fragrance Hey guys only got three packages to go out today i go to the post office every day it's literally not even a minute away from me um so i do send out packages every day my big day is typically monday from the weekend orders but god is good i get orders every day then i had to get some alcohol y'all you know you know so let's go hey, ain't nobody here i hate this thing is broke sure they're gone and i'm out that's the perks of shipping from home you just dump it that's all you gotta do Oop. all you all you have to do is dump it you don't even have to do that you can arrange for somebody to come pick it up every day or um just give it to your mailman you gotta have a nice oh my nose we running when i take these masks off you gotta have a nice postman though if you like me and get a lot, 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 packages. Oh, y'all see that too? Yeah. Oh, okay, nah, but for real. Yeah, I'm cheating on my, oh, shit. Oh, I always do that. I'm cheating on my own self, but I got to get rid of this. It's the Sol Hanera. My face is so dry. The packaging looked like this because my ass was like peeling it off because I saw something. And girl, let me tell y'all what they did, but I ain't mad. <laughs> They got their bum bum Brazilian crush spray, I mean. So what they did was just took their bottles and put a label on it that say hand sanitizer so they didn't have to buy small bottles. I'm with them. I'm tired of looking dusty, boy. It's time. Hold on to my eye so I can spray this steering wheel. God be with me. Okay, let go. So guess what? What? They upgraded our room and gave us free parking. What? <laughs> VIP, y'all look at y'all homeboy. Pow, pow. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, we in this thing. Okay. 
Oh, very spacious up in here. Oh, gosh. So, go out and watch people. Huh? Hello, I can't hear you. I said, wait, you got to the bathroom. Exactly. Leave it up to Nicole to leave her face mask. So now we can't go into any of the restaurants or whatever. Gotta find a mask, but I think this is good. Wipes and hand sanitizer. So she went out on the balcony because honey, she can't stand the smell and I don't have Lysol. So I have to hand sanitizer everything down. I already did the room. Like especially metal. Yeah. So it's gonna get real strong in her. Woo -hoo. So I'm about to book a pedicure, but I got chicken strips and fruit, and Nicole got a pizza. You know, I still gotta eat. So we're about to eat. <laughs> I don't, oh. Got painting over there, you wanna paint? Yeah. So, I did my nails. We're at the pool. Yeah, my swimsuit just ain't working out for me. I got it a few weeks ago and it's just like, bag is sagging, but it's cute. But look, <laughs> and plan to wake up and um go to straight to the wedding, but she couldn't get up. I was motherfucking tired. We went to bed kind of late, and um, and the pimple right here. Hate when I be in between my eyes like that. And it is they wouldn't extend checkout beyond twelve, and the wedding is not till five, four, 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 four. So we literally would have had to like get fully dressed, wake up, get fully dressed and find something to do for like three and a half, four hours um, before the wedding. So we're just gonna go home. So I decided to order Dr. Pepper ribs, smoked cheddar grits and sweet and sour Brussels sprouts at 10 o'clock at night. So me and Nicole just shared it, so I don't have to eat a whole, whole, whole bunch of food. I guess we don't motherfuckers left up in here. And I was so scared I was gonna get sick, but I didn't. And it was so good. Oh my gosh. I ain't never had hotel food like that. Everybody gone, they could have let us stay. We're headed to the wedding. For him, I'm gonna put a little shimmy shimmy fashion over. Okay. <laughs> to try to dip in and get a pedicure and say they're open but it's nobody out here maybe that's a good thing that mean nobody's in there so i need it bad y'all i gotta um what you call it on my toe um ingrown and if i let my toe big toe grow out too much it starts hurting so let's see if they are uh, holla holla i need to come back too is this 20 percent off i'm here now <laughs> Yeah. 
I feel like a new woman. Look, I even got, look at the, oh. They look way better though, but look, look at this. That's from wearing them slides, they be cutting my toes. Gotta stay out of those. All right guys, so it's Get It Monday. The bitch is tired. First of all, I had a long weekend and I, I haven't been doing much. So that was exhausting to do all that this weekend. Y'all don't have the option where you leave a key to a bigger box so I don't have to bug you so much? Oh, okay. <laughs> Tuesday guys. Hold up, hold up, hold up, y'all, because I got y'all this. Alright, it's Tuesday, guys. I am headed to um a funeral home to get my mama a new tombstone. I'm gonna stop out of bank first because I think I'm gonna drive the cash. I want the big boy. Big boy. Yeah, she's so geeked. I tipped her fifty dollars for being so nice and helping me. She said, I'm gonna go buy me a dress. <laughs> so I said, What you do for a little? I say YouTube. <laughs> it's my card. <laughs> all right guys, so that's done and it just the mask be having gloss all under my nose. Look like my nose running. I'm gonna stop by the post office because I gotta go that way anyway to get home. Um, and that just brought out like a slur of emotions. Like, it's been, my mama died in 01, y'all, and this shit don't get easier. Like, people say it gets easier. No, you just, you psych your mind out. Like, uh, I'm trying not to cry, but you psych your, y'all don't see me cry like the last four blogs. I ain't about to do it. Be strong, girl. Nah, but it's okay to not be strong too. Don't let somebody convince you that you always have to be strong. But anyway, um, a slur of emotions because like y'all don't understand how you should value your mom, especially if it's a good mom. Your mom, period, because they brought you into this world, but I understand some people have horrible moms, so I, you get what I'm saying. But um, because I feel like I just went through so much because I didn't have one. Like, so much trial and error, um, so fucked up ass decisions that I would love to do videos about and bring up and help people, um, and teenagers, because I lost my mind when I was a teenager, um, that's going through the same thing, but you guys, not you guys, but I don't, I don't know who watched me, so it might be you guys, judge so hard on these platforms that I feel like it will backfire on me, and I regret that I let people into my space like that and I'm not mentally there I still go to therapy so I'm not mentally there for somebody to try to like come up in my space and make me feel a certain type of way because I just want to fight like bitch who are you pull up you get what I'm saying so and I can't react to everything like that <gasps> bitch I know you fucking lying I missed my turn to the post office but well, good thing I know this route. I can go another way. But it's like very. What, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like so. Like the group of people I hung with, and the stuff I let people convince me to do, the stuff I started doing, the stuff I didn't get away with, and how it all molded me to be who I am today. That's why I'm like so close to baby girl because I do not want my baby to go through all that I went through. Yeah, I went through hell. Like my whole family just like fell out fell off the face of the earth when my mama died to me and I went through hell with people who I thought was friends and stuff and made a lot of bad choices so anyway um yeah not I won't say my family well when I when my mom died two weeks later my dad moved out and they was married 37 years two months later my dad was remarried um that's a whole uh, video in itself and then my brothers just scattered so I went from having like this household where mom and dad, well my brothers was grown, but mom, dad, my brothers, all us, church every Sunday together, eating every Sunday together, and then it was just me. So that was like a big, 
adjustment for me and I made a lot of dumbass decisions. I'm not, I don't regret any of them because they got me through what I needed to be at through the time. I don't care what it was. It got me through. Do you hear me? It got me through and fed my kids. So anyway, um, yeah, that was a quick little rant, but yeah, that was just emotional. Check that more of the story is value your mama, y'all. I, I know, I know, I know, because I get on shoot motherfucking nerves. I know your mama ring your nerves, y'all, but just imagine not even having it. Like, <sighs> okay. Yeah. Dealing with these masks, I learned I got some good old bitty ass ears. Oh, at the post office, again. Yeah, I got the smallest damn ears in history. Gotta go pick up a package. Let me get my shorts out my cooter though. I don't like that. <laughs> this is fashion over, y'all can't see it. It look like a maxi dress. Hold on, cause I'm wearing it like somebody green, honey. It look like a maxi dress, but it's going to shorts. So. Box. I'm going to be recording tonight. This is from J Majesty Hair Collection. Okay, I think she sent stuff for me and baby girl. Right and early to come to the outlet while no one is here. I look a mess, so I'm really in for one thing and one thing only. Okay, where is the sign telling me to go? This way, this way. Let's go. So, since I'm here, see if they got anything. All right, guys, so that was in and out. I got what I needed. So, uh, yeah, let me go on over to Michael Cooler. See, this is my problem. I know it's a shortcut from here. Let me see. I don't want to get lost. Yep. <laughs> this girl know her shopping. All right, guys. So, Suge didn't like her slides. And so, I was going to come here and exchange them. But, but, she like snared her nose up at them and gave me this funky attitude. So, I'm going to teach her motherfucking ass about being an un unappreciative is that the word hmm yeah I don't like that you can't have a sense of entitlement and you broke I don't care what I got I'm the one at work and spend the coins not her don't snare your do damn nose up at me so they will be going back so I've made the makeup artist one of the models and the other model goodie bags. They each got a fashion over purse, something from Bath and Body Work, one of my sanitizers, and a lot of makeup in here. So that's gonna be their gifts for doing the shoot. So let me finish preparing. Guys, right, so I'm at the hotel. This is why I picked it. Everything is freaking purple. It's like a dream hotel. Um, but let me go ahead and Nicole will park in because <laughs> she'll get us towed. Let's go. Even the lobby. Look at the lobby, guys. So, they gave me a ring light for free. Excuse the wig, y'all, but, oh. Uh, it's a small little room, but usually, um, <laughs> usually downtown rooms are small in, in anywhere. But I can get the purple. You know, a little purple. Okay. It's my view. Bag that thing on back. But yeah. Yeah, a little light. So yeah, let me bag back. I ain't got good. Look at the free light the man gave me. And gave us free ballet. He got the little, you wanna put your phone? That's pivoting. He says somebody left it. It's been here about three months and it looked like I would use something like this. Let me see what the different, oh, oh. Up the stuff. This is the models. Um, 
This is their gifts and their pieces that they're gonna be modeling. And um, over here, I am setting up some snacks. I'm setting up some snacks, so that's over there. Um, I'm thinking we're gonna shoot in here, so I'm gonna have house cleaning come clean up. And Nicole is gonna leave because of course, she don't wanna stick around while I shoot shapewear. That's like invasive like underwear or whatever. So yeah, I'm just sitting out snacks in case anybody gets hungry. Or something like that, like beef jerky, popcorn, uh, cheese it's got some food snacks. What I didn't get is drinks, but luckily it's like a 7-Eleven across the street. So that's that. She brought me a gift. She don't know she got a gift over there too. <laughs> Say hey, Keish. Hey. Y'all remember her from Miami? <laughs> Let's Look, see what I, I got. Seeing them about to get ready to start popping up their pieces. Oh. Hey, it look like to me the world open back up. <laughs> what did it say? Me? Oh, minding my black owned business. Oh, I show <laughs> live. I show <sure> live. <laughs> But uh, black, strong, and proud. What's this, a face mask? Yeah. Thank you, Keisha. You want to open your gift? I shouldn't open. <laughs> Just some thank you gifts. Oh, yes. Yeah, I call for my phone. Get real bubbly. So bad. It's some stuff in the purse. Uh -oh. <laughs> Take the purse Just some. I know you don't do a lot of makeup, so I put a lip gloss in. Moving, y'all. So we'll get locked in. Oh, okay. Oh, it's bigger, is it? Nah, this is just a regular room. But this will work, huh? Oh, babe, come here. Oh, put the thing in the door like that. Because I want y'all to shoot the e-commerce on a plain wild look. This better for, I mean, it's good. One room to shoot and do makeup and then, okay, so I'm- My Chastity doing makeup. Here's our gift. I hope she like it. All right, let's see what we got, y'all. <laughs> and if you want any of the shape or just let me know. I got you. Yeah. Baby, she gotta tape down, she don't want me to get her. <laughs> she got me taped down and she don't want me to get up in here. See what we got. All right, y'all, I'm almost there. <gasps> I have a lotion. And see what this is. Hold on, we're finished. Hold on. Got a little fashion note. Wait a minute. Yes, I will be rocking this. My anniversary is coming up, so I will be wearing it. Ah, happy Thank anniversary. You, you got stuff in it. Oh, hold on, y'all. Hello, y'all. What's minute? See what we got in here. See, see. You got a little hug. She loves you down with gifts. I'm not going to tell y'all what all this is. Y'all can just look. I can't wait to look back there. Yay. We're going to be roommates. Oh, my God. Nicole going to be like, uh-uh. You can't hang out with no more. I got a lot of little goodies in here, y'all. This is bloated. Uh, brushes? They never have too many brushes. <laughs> never. I tried to oh customize it. So cute. Mm -hmm. If y'all ever work with Nikki, be expecting a good gift. <laughs> I always get good gifts. Thank you. You're welcome. She said, do her vlog, y'all. Let me see. <laughs> I got you. Oh, I want to be a model. <laughs> oh my goodness, I need this. Because I've been very stressed out lately. We all have. We're going to get through it. Yep. And look, I got a purse. <laughs> Baby, thank you. Baby, thank you. <laughs> it got oh, stuff in it. I got something to work with this. It's going to work, girl. <laughs> Purple again. <laughs> Cotton candy and uh -oh. And I got overnight pill. I be needing it. 
<laughs> Get off my nerves. Man, and test butter gloss like this is a bitch. Oh my god. Lemon balm. <laughs> and oh, that's a highlighter, right? Yes, honey, you gotta and glow. Glowy glowy. Lips, glowy skin. <laughs> Thank you, Nikki. You're welcome. And that's the other bag is the pieces you're modeling. So hungry. <laughs> so your girl about to go get her mammogram. I think. Or I'm going to see my doctor to make me appointment to get a mammogram. Like why I just can't go get a fucking mammogram, y'all. know I need it. But let's go. I'm low-key ready to fight. Right. Oh my face. I can see my weight loss in my face. Thank you, Jesus. But anyway. I went through all that shit and it was just a screening to get the mammogram. Bro, I left the hotel last night. I got the hotel till today. I could still be laid up at the hotel. Like, but y'all yeah, motherfucker ass, let me drive home because my doctor is closer to my house. Right? And all you did was refer to me. So my mammogram is technically not to September 14th. All you did was, and then referred me. I could have still been in the bed. You could have referred me over the damn phone. You don't believe you. Don't, you the one told me I need a mammogram. Then so you should just refer me. But you gonna make me come in to tell you I'm here for a mammogram just to. Uh, yeah, when I tell y'all, 2020 is so ghetto. Sorry, I just woke up. So, um, first of all, I had a ugh, terrible night because you know. Our Black Panther died, and I haven't been on here all week almost because I've been resting because ever since I got back from getting the mammogram, not getting the mammogram, going to the doctor to get scheduled to get the mammogram, I have been under attack. I had a good week last week, made it through the photo shoot and everything, and then all of a sudden this whole week I thought I was under girl attack, but end up what happening was I started my cycle. I only have a cycle like every five months now. <clears throat> so it just really came out of nowhere. And yeah, the whole week I've been experiencing PMS and thought it was good. It's just everything I think is good. So that's the first. And then, you know, our Black Panther died and that shit really hit me because it's just like that man did all that sick in between chemo in between surgeries like oh i just can't even think about it next and then <clears throat> around 12 o'clock my dad started experiencing pain then by two o'clock in the morning it was excruciating where he was screaming and hollering so i had to call 911 because i couldn't even get him in a car to get him to the hospital um so he's still there they're keeping him some days um to test and see what's going on. Right now, they're saying that there's a blockage in his intestines. That's why he's been in so much pain. So, yeah, we were scheduled to go to um, 
go on a staycation and finish my part of the shoot because I never got the shoot because um because I was still getting makeup. Um but I don't even feel like doing that now. I know the show must go on. I got a website to launch. I need pictures. But I, I'm just not feeling it right now. So maybe I will in a couple of hours because I didn't get any sleep. But it's kind of hard for me to be at a hotel shooting. And my dad is in a hospital. But I guess if it was a regular 9 to 5, I would still have to work. So I'll figure it out later. And I'll be back later, guys. All right, guys, so the doctor just called and said it's not looking good. She said that his intestines are obstructed and twisting and scarred real bad. And um, she says since he's been there, it's roughly, what time is it, Shug? 224. It's 224. The ambulance came and got him around 2.30 a.m. It's 12 hours later, and she said that it's getting worse as he's at the hospital. Um, she said they were trying to control it through some tubes and stuff in his nose and his throat but it's getting worse and the blood and oxygen is not reaching. I don't know if it's oxygen, but the blood and stuff is not reaching his intestines and they don't want him to like die for good. So they are going to call me in two hours and let me know if they're going to take him to surgery in two hours. So of course he's panicking anxiety because who wants to go into surgery? Um, but um, yeah, that's what I know as of right now. So he had to go back in for emergency surgery yesterday. It was like the worst. Um, he called and was like, he don't want to have surgery again. He's tired. Um, he was telling me where his insurance paper were, his extra money, and it just took me, y'all. So, like, I had anxiety attack and everything, but my family and everything started calling him and praying and talked him into go ahead and having surgery. So, anyway, what happened was um, they put three incisions in him like pinky size instead of cutting them up the middle like they did for the other surgery and that's when they found out what was going on in there they don't know what caused it or um anything like that but they said they don't see anything abnormal like any more cancer tumors or anything like that it's just his int intestines were flipping out and he's in icu and they're monitoring him monitoring him closely um for now so yeah I don't know. Everything was going fine, and then boom. But that's kind of how 2020 is going, right? So, um, yeah, I don't want to hold y'all long. Just an update.